Well, finally, we wanted to share the news that our friends at the Nashville Shakespeare Festival are returning to the stage later this month. Ed Jones has the details on their summer event. That I am more than Prospero, master of a full poor cell. And the I footlights shone more brightly more for the Nashville Shakespeare Festival in 2019. After 30 years of performances at Centennial Park, its first summer festival at one city was a rousing success. Then came 2020. You fools! As executive artistic director Denise Hicks remembers all too well. The Nashville Shakespeare Festival has been presenting free Shakespeare every summer since 1988. Um, the summer of 2020 is the only year that we did not produce, so we're really excited about this comeback year. And we are so excited that we are doing two shows. Uh, for the first time in our history, we are doing a play by August Wilson that will open the festival. Uh, that play is called Jitney, set in Pittsburgh in, 19, in the 70s, and uh, it's about a group of men who formed their own cab company uh, to serve the black community when white cab drivers wouldn't go into their neighborhoods. It's a funny story about really serious things. It's also the festival's first collaboration with Kenny Playhouse Theater, the brainchild of artistic director Kenny Dozier, whose high caliber productions made an impression on Denise. I didn't know who she was. I just kept looking up at my audience as this strange little lady in my audience. <laughs> and she would always say something positive. Kenny's choices of plays, the talent, the caliber of talent that he attracts always uh, just impressed me. I was always impressed with his shows. And after producing for 14 years here in Nashville with very few resources, that he just needed a bigger platform. So Summer Shakespeare is a great step forward for, for his company and his theater and his artistry because now many more people will get to see it. Uh, we have a good two-week run with an extra weekend in Franklin this summer yes. with, the, uh, with Jitney. And that pairs up nicely with Twelfth Night by Shakespeare, which is a rollicking, family-friendly, musical comedy experience for everybody. So the festival is bigger and better this year, and we're all really excited about that. And you can't beat the price. It's actually a free event. It's actually free, and uh, you can buy what we call VIP royal seats. We have about 25 per show, but even if you don't pay the extra money to get a VIP royal seat, you can still sit up front or lay up front on a blanket, sit in a chair, and so just come in, find your spot, dig on in, and let's have a good time. NashvilleShakes.org, <laughs> CanYouPlayhouseTheater.com. Come and see, it's gonna be great.